Hi guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today we're back. Argyle back on the road, Swansea City versus Plymouth Argyle. Last time these two teams faced was the 7th of October 2023, earlier on in the season at Home Park, where Swansea took the points in a 3-1 win. Before that, on the 25th of August 2021, up at Swansea's ground, Argyle won the end of a 4-1 loss. And before that again, the points were shared in a 1-1 draw at Home Park on the 16th of February 2010. And as the league form stands, the hosts Swansea currently stands 17th with 33 points come to this game after a 3-1 away loss to Leicester, a 3-1 home loss to Southampton and a away 2-2 draw to Birmingham. Now as for Argyle, zero points uh, are between the two sides. Argyle currently stand 15th, two places higher, which makes this game really a six pointer for both, se both teams. Argyle obviously without an away win but unbeaten in the new year with Ian Foster, new manager, coming to this game after a 3-1 home win over Swansea rivals Cardiff. Before that, a 1-1 away draw to Huddersfield and before that, on the opening day of the year, a 3-3 free -free, uh, thriller at home to Watford. Now, the transfer window has ended. Uh, we've had some ins, some outs, some amazing news for Argyle fans. Some bad news though with Houghton, Houghton being out uh, with an ankle injury for possibly the next three games. A huge loss, but with the the incoming of Adam Forshaw before um, before the end of the deadline, obviously we've got that that backup there, that reassurance. Butcher going uh, to Wickham, so is Early Saxon Early. Butcher going on a permanent. Early going on a on a loan to Wickham. Seems like we're building a bond there, with, which Argyle fans. For me personally, myself, not too fond on as obviously Wickham and Argyle throughout the years have not had the the best of the best of uh, chemistry, let's just say. Uh, and and incoming another left sided wing back, I believe, in Lino Sousa from Villa comes for the end of the season. But the big news is Wicker stays. We're buzzing with that. Obviously, obviously, when we had that off, offer from Lazio, I think it was in the region of about fifteen million. My heart was in my hands. I was, I was, I was. Gutted if he went, because obviously he's been our, ma our main star man this year. But yeah, I'm shattered. Um, going up with a dad today, 6.30 leave, up to Swansea. Not too far of a travel. Let's get up there. Can't agree. Hey there. We're in Swansea. You can see the ground behind me, the harvesters. Probably the closest distance to a pub to a ground, which, which I've been a long time. We've got calls to the queue, obviously. Being outside the ground has been bombarded with fans. Um, so we've we got two, two cores, Dad got two car lanes, £19, not a bad price. Yes, yeah, decent. Really my big lineup here. One big thing I've missed out is Gibson. Uh, I don't know what's went through my head. Uh, missing him out, obviously. Him, I think he'll play Scar. Huge opportunity to get three points on the Tight, tight uh, in the table between the two sides. I'm excited for him. Also going to leave Jacob Sucker at XR. You might see it from, my, uh, from the link in the last video on my uh, Instagram story. Just go, go find me at the moment. If, if you are any opportunity and you can, uh, you know, donate some money. It's for a good cause for his son, for his little boy. Any dads out there would know if you do anything for your little boy. So if you can help them out, please do so. Ready for the football. Hopefully I've got three points. Hopefully we will not make mass pass. So in the stadium now, lineup up towers, Hazard, Plumber, Hardy, Wick, and Miller, Devine, Gibson, Wabby, Galloway, Phillips, Warshaw. So I'm pretty sure on my on my predicted lineup, I've got it near enough spot on obviously the only mistake scar for Gibson, which I did speak about. Strong lineup. <clears throat> uh, no scar on the bench, no bundle on the bench. Robert Tazaka, Sorolina, Wayne, Wright. Play this way, little Randall, and obviously Burton uh, in goal. Like I said, strong line that we're going to need us today. Decent size stadium, I mean, good view from where we are at the moment. Dad, score Victor. 2 0 ah, And I'm going with Hob, all the way. Score yeah. Um, I went for 2 1. 2 1. Um, 2 1, and Whitaker could have scored. Yeah, Whitaker, the other goal here, obviously, is quite disrespectful. I've gone with a 2 1 half goal. Hopefully three points for you guys.
Half time, surprisingly, Swansea nil, Argo one. We're winning away, and it had to be him, the man himself, the ex Swan, Morgan Waker with a goal. We scored from the corner, so many disbeliefs uh, in this first 45 minutes. But I do feel like Swansea, they've had the better chances. That save from Connor Hazard, wow, wow. Two arguable penalty shouts uh, for Swansea, which, as an Argo fan, if we get it given against us, we're We'd be, we'd feel hard done by, we'd feel like the ref has done poor. Um, lines when well, the officials overall, I don't think have been too great. It's all to play for in the second half. We've, we've obviously got one to the good, but we need to push on, get a second, get the job done, and take the three points back home. Hopefully, we can do it. On the good. Wow, full time, Swansea nil, Argo one. You can hear it in the background, we've won away. Carnage. I don't know if you can hear it in the mic. We've won away. We've won away. Hey, buzz it. Huge confidence boost going on to Sunderland. Obviously, he needs in the cup. 
Moss words, speechless. Fozzie's out the wheel. We move on. Up the other. <laughs>